Hello everyone, welcome back to me trying and struggling to free my computer of lag while maybe building a computer, or I don't know at this point if my computer doesn't lag out too much, pretty much anything. Anyway, a very certain helpful someone under the Discord name SBO has uh, given me some <clears throat> very helpful tips on how to make this smaller, faster, and more efficient. So, first of all, this 8-bit adder, no. It's huge. This full adder, no. Any component that was built with two or more things, all of the not gates, The X and OR gate can go, and the OR gate can go. Uh, so all we have left is an AND gate and an OR gate. So let's spawn an AND gate real quick. And these can be cathodes, not just... Um, they don't just have... Uh, it's not frozen. They don't have to be metal. This makes it easier. It might delay it a little bit, but I can see what's going on, so I don't care. And I'm going to color code this. At Almost everything in this video has come as thanks thanks to uh, SBO's wonderful ideas. Uh, pretty much none of these are mine, so I gotta thank him for that. Okay, so let's test this out. No, okay. Okay, but both, there we go. So blue is output and green, uh, no, blue is input, green is output. I cannot uh, state how much SPO was helpful, so I'll just say it again. Thank you very, very much, SPO. This is going to be our new AND gate. Save, and now, OR gate. It's the exact same thing as the AND gate, just without the syringe and with that retracted. So, right click on and on. Great. This will be our OR gate. And this should be a NOR gate. So it should only output something, or it, hold on, what's the truth table of a NOR gate? And as SPO pointed out, you can only really build a NOT gate if you inbuild it into the system, so I'm not going to build a NOT gate. But it should only output true if both of them are off. So this does not work. I need my AND gate. And do I just reverse these positions? I think that's it. So off, off. if I turn both of them on. Yeah, okay, so this is our NAND gate. Kind of. Yeah. Um, stupid shortcut doesn't work. And then if I No, 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 no. That was a NOR gate. I caught something. NOR gate. Great. And then, where is my, I don't want, what is this? The NAND gate should not exist, yeah. And then the uh, OR gate, actually, if I reverse these positions, Oh, wrong one. Okay. This should be... Uh, 
I saved as a NOR gate, right? Good. Okay. This should be our NAND gate. Uh, so it should only output zero if both of these are on. Good. Okay, so this is our NAND gate. Great. And as SPO pointed out again, I could construct a no, stop moving. You don't get to move. An XOR gate. Um like this. Freeze these all. So he pointed out through a series of long, complicated Discord messages that um, an OR gate only changes its output state when its input state is toggled. So let's look up an XOR gate truth table. It should only output when one of the inputs is on. So on, on. Perfect. Works. This is our XOR gate now. Uh, the cathodes are mostly to help me to, you know, see stuff. That's just really all they're there for. Um. And then the X, this should be the XNOR gate truth table. This should be an XNOR gate. So, XNOR. You should only output one when uh, both of the inputs are off or on. So, works. Perfect. This is our XNOR gate. Great. Now we need to rebuild our 8-bit adder, but that's easier since the gates are now smaller. So what's the half adder truth table real quick? Hold on. Let me look at something. Sorry, I'm just looking through the messages. I wonder if I can make these more compact because they're pretty large. Yeah, first of all, that can be a syringe. Second of all, that can be smushed down there. This can be smushed up here. And there is our significantly compactified AND gate. Where is our OR gate? Same thing here. Remove that. Copy that, paste that, rotate it this way, smush this into there. This is not going to be a very interesting part just because I'm basically just redesigning everything. So this is the NOR gate I pasted, right? Let me just check. Yeah, it's the NOR gate. All right. This computer isn't going to be fast by any means of the word fast. 
I'm really just trying to make it so that I can, I can understand it and debug the computer if need be. So, yeah. So now we need to rebuild the half adders. Uh, sorry, schematic is what I want. This game works really weird because all the logic is based on toggling, not actually like how computers work. So, yeah, this is gonna be fun. XOR gate and an AND gate. But you see, I'm probably gonna get rid of those cathodes and just hard code it in. So here's our two inputs. Here's our one output. It will be here. Two outputs, really. There should be two outputs. Of course, I forget to freeze them just because I'm me. This is just about the most compact half adder I can do. Let's do a half adder truth table. When I input zero zero, I should get zero. I'm sorry, what? There we go. All right, so that's good. Also good. If I do both, good, very, very good. This is our half adder. And now we find a full adder schematic. Where are you? Okay, so we need two half adders. Where is my half out of there it is? Do 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 where's my work gate? Great. Okay. This will be the carry output and it will be the carry output of these two, sorry. But the sum of this half adder will go into the sum of this half adder. And this is our sum output right here. That is our sum. I'm going to ask you very politely, Piston, to stop doing that. Stop. Calm down, Piston. 
Are we gonna do this again? No, stop it. If you're going to be like that. Okay, I was just in the middle of redesigning a the full adder when I was interrupted. So let's try that again. There's the two half adders. There's the OR gate. This is the direct output of the carry. And this would be the direct output of the sum. Danya, please stop. So then, these are our three inputs. The bottom one is always carry. I'm not wanting this to be fast. Wrong half adder. Okay. I don't want this to be fast. I want it to be readable. So that's why I'm living with the delay. I built it wrong again. What an IQ I have. B and carry. And then this feeds into there. This feeds into there, and that feeds into there. 
this is frozen and that is our full adder so one good two good three good one and two carry good one and three good two and three good and then yeah that's right now we need to make this smaller because that is huge and I do not like huge in computers that are meant to have lots and lots of parts so there is a full adder new tricks there great now where's my half adder good okay so half adder that's a lot larger than I thought it would be full adder full adder oh we aren't very high up off the ground are we just seven full adders that I've got to place not a problem no okay fine I can live with that uh, spawn another one in and move it how many three four Four, I said. Five. Six. Great, it's just as big as the other one. But it should work, if I'm not mistaken. And then our outputs, eight of them, or nine of them really. One, two. And then the carry. Some, some carry. Carry. Some, some carry. Carry some, some carry, carry some.
carry some. Dip, dip. Ah, yes. Carry. Great. The outputs have been completed. Now the inputs. Are they frozen? Ah, see? That would have been a bad thing to do. Why did I do that? Well, at least it's better on my computer in terms of frames. There we go. There are our inputs who will now be promptly frozen. Did I freeze him? No. Good. Pair one. Pair two. Oh, hold on. No, these aren't electric wires. I gotta do this. Good. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Great. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, let's do the same test we did in the last video. One, zero, one, zero, one, zero. I did the wrong thing. This is a light shoe. Zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, zero, one. Okay, we've just duplicated our answer. That is good. Zero, zero, one, one, zero, zero. I read it from the wrong side again. One, one, zero, zero, one, one, zero, zero. Should be one, zero. One 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 zero one one and no carry. Good or half out of works. Now I just gotta manually deactivate every single one of these. Compactify it a lot. And beautiful. This is our new half adder. Or 8 bit adder. Great. My frames are done. There they go. They're back. There. Now let's build a subtractor. Okay. Let's build a subtractor. So, also, hold on, I'm going to make a revision to the not gates like these. I think, um, 
that just as a reminder whenever I use them I need to activate the next thing manually I should use a red one like this what did I just spawn in um at the NAND gate I think it was yeah okay let me pay more attention to this stuff This is a NOR gate. I know this for certain. I. I think that's going to be have to be it for this because I have to go. Well, see you guys.